we all would have observed this 12 squared box. According to Vedic astrology, the planets positioned in these 12 squares are blueprint of the life of that person. Based on the time of birth of that person, this horoscope is prepared by observing the stars and planets in the celestial sphere. By recognizing the star rising in the sky at the time of the birth, this 12 square zodiac horoscope can be designed. In turn, many other horoscopes can be designed based on this. The different horoscopes are Navamsha Kundali, Hora Kundali, Saptamsha Kundali, Shodashamsha Kundali, Vishamsha Kundali, Aksha Vedamsha Kundali, Shastamsha Kundali, and so on. Astrology says that likewise more than 150 horoscopes can be designed. Let us try to understand positioning of the celestial stars and planets in these 12 squares of the horoscope. The celestial sphere is divided into 12 parts, keeping the earth as a center and now we can see respective star and planet in the same part of the horoscope. At the birth time of a child, keeping the earth as a center, stars and planets are observed and recorded in the 12 squares which is called horoscope. Now let us name and simplify this to understand the position of the planets in the 12 squared box. The 12 parts of the celestial sphere are Aries, Taurus, Gemini, Cancer, Leo, Virgo, Libra, Scorpio, Sagittarius, Capricorn, Aquarius and Pisces. Now the Sun in the Aries, Moon and Jupiter in the Cancer, Saturn in the Libra, Mars in the Capricorn, Venus and Mercury in the Pisces. Also the Rahu and Ketu are marked and recognizing the lunar points. This is the way the horoscope is written in South India based on rising zodiac constellation. In the Northern and Eastern India, the patterns differs. In the North Indian pattern, the square of the Lagna is the first and fundamental square. In some parts of the Eastern India, this pattern of the Kundali is written which is the fusion of North and South Indian style. In totality, these three Kundalis are different in the pattern but not in the positioning of the planets. With all thanks to Ahoratra who is encouraging the study of astrology. This is Shunga Priyam.